Hi everyone! Welcome back to my craft room. If you're new to my craft room, then welcome. Today is Friday. It's time for my Dollar Tree haul. Um, they did have a lot of uh, Easter things out. They still don't have them all out yet. I was a little disappointed. A lot of empty shelves still. But I did pick up a lot of cute things. So this is actually the only boring thing that I picked up. The rest of it is just fun stuff for crafting and decorating or whatever. So I grabbed my Good Sense um, handle garbage bags. They're the 13 gallon size and they have the vanilla scent to them. I love these. I'm always picking those up. But that was it. I don't think I bought anything else like that. So they had these out as the item of the week and I purchased a bunch of these last year. Last year I got the owl and I got the frog. And they were so cute. They've been outside ever since last summer, and they still work. They've worked all winter. Their little lights here on their face are so bright. And this is a cute little turtle. Now, see if he has any power in him. The one I did try to light up, and it did light up, but they haven't been outside yet. So he doesn't have any. They're solar powered. Um, he doesn't have anything. I'm one of these guys I did. So I got the cute little turtle. That one was new. Oh, there he goes. He is on. And their little lights are just so bright, and they're so cute. And I got this cute little fox. I think it's a fox. I was kind of debating whether it was a fat squirrel or a fox. But either way, it's adorable. And, um, yeah, see how bright they are? They're so cute, and they look so nice out by my flowers all summer long. They look so pretty. And all winter, I left them out there, and they're still going strong. So I grabbed those two, and they did have the owls, and they did have the um, frogs again this year. But I didn't pick up another one of those, because mine are still working fine from last year. So that was a couple of new things that I saw. And I picked up this cute little sign that you can stick out in your yard. It's just a um, Easter egg. But I'm hoping I can pop this off here, because I think I'd kind of like to use this for the center of my Easter wreath when I get around to making that. I think that would be really cute. So I grabbed that. It has a nice little stake on it if you just want to stick them out in your flower beds or whatever. And my daffodils are starting to peek through the ground, so I was excited to see that too today when I came home. And then I grabbed these cute little bunnies. They kind of look like um, the candy peeps that you get at Easter time. And there's four of these on a little stick, little bunny picks. And they had them in a bunch of different, they had a purple one and they had, I can't remember what the other color was. It might have been green, but I just picked up a pack of the pink because I thought they were really cute. So I got those and they had tons and tons and tons of the mesh. I was so happy. This is the six inch mesh and there's five yards on here. So when I go to make my um, Easter wreath, I have plenty now. They had the purple, I got three of the purple, three of the blue, I got three of the white, and then I got three of the pretty pink. So yeah, they actually had a lot of this, I was surprised. Usually I can find like a couple here and there in different stores, but they were, must have just got these out today, because they were loaded with those. And then I picked up a pack of these cute little erasers. I got these last year. They're the same ones, I believe. And I used them all up in friends' mail and stuff. But I'm going to use these in some DIYs, I think, this year. They're so cute. And you get eight of them in here. And let's see. I picked up a pack of these little foam Easter eggs. They're nice and glittery, pretty different colors. It's a 12-piece bag, and they have all little ribbons on them, so if you wanted to hang them or whatever, I probably won't. I'll probably cut the ribbons off and use them in some DIYs. But I thought they were really pretty. <clears throat> and I don't think that's anything new. I think they had those last year. And I think I've seen people haul these last year, too. I did, never, did not ever see them in any of my Dollar Trees last year. But it's cute. There's six little eggs, like in a carton. And they're nice speckled little eggs. And I thought those would look really nice, like in a centerpiece or something. So I got two of those, I think. Let me see here. Yes, I did. I picked up two packs of those. And these were the only colors they had. I don't know if they have any other colors out, but I grabbed two of them. And then I grabbed just a couple of these little foam balls. 
that I want to use in a DIY this weekend. I'm hoping to get it up. It's, it's going to be really cute and different. Trust me, this one's going to be different. And then I grabbed a pack of these cute little carrots. I thought these were nice. And they have like a, um, I guess it's almost like an orange jute string on it. And it has the cute little leaves. And you get four of them. And I thought they would be cute to use in some centerpieces and things for Easter or just for spring. So I grabbed those. And then I picked up some ribbon. They had a lot of pretty ribbon. I got this one. And this is two and a half inches wide and there's three yards on here so I got this one here with the pretty little Easter eggs and then I got this one it's just like a little design here with all the pretty pastel colors and these are all the wired um, ribbon and this has three yards they all have three yards and then I picked up this pretty flower one for spring I thought that would be nice so that's the three of those that I got I didn't have any of that stuff left over from last year. And then I picked up this cute little bunny. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with him yet. I don't know if I can get him all in frame here. I'll put him sideways. Um, he just hangs up. It's just a little white bunny with a bow. I figure there's something I'll think of to do with this little guy. But I thought that was a cute little idea of just a little white bunny. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do with him yet. And it's just kind of like, oh, it has like a, on a little frame. And it's kind of like, like a garland wrapped decoration like they've had before of other things. And then I picked up two of these back scratchers. These are made out of bamboo. And this is also going to be in my DIY this weekend. Hopefully I get this up because this is going to be a fun one. But they always have these at the Dollar Tree, these little back scratchers. And then I picked up two of these little craft bottles. I thought these were so cute to put little things in. You could put candy in them. I hope I'm getting this now. I can't see what I'm doing here today. Um, they're just called craft bottle. And it shows where they put a little bunny on there and some grass and some candy inside. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with them yet. But I thought, oh, my little guy's lighting up back here because I'm getting stuff around them. Um, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with them yet. I thought they were really cute, and they're, you know, not real flimsy. They don't, you know how like the Christmas ones, they, they were kind of, you squeezed them a little bit, and they were, they would squish, but these don't. These are uh, pretty sturdy. So we shall see. These are four inches tall. So we'll figure out something with those for Easter, or something else. Who knows? And then I grabbed some Easter candy. And these were the Russell Stover's. These were the uh, coconut mini eggs and dark chocolate. So I got a pack of those. I put these away somewhere so I'm not picking at them. And then there's a pack of marshmallow mini eggs. These are Russell Stover's also. And um, it's just a two, almost a three ounce bag, 2.95. And I'm sure there's not a ton in here, but I do love Russell Stover's candy. So those will be mine. And then I picked up a couple bags the little foil wrapped eggs. This is the milk chocolate ones that they have. I got these last year. I thought they were pretty good, actually. Sometimes, you know, you get some of the cheaper candy and it kind of has a little funky taste. And this is also the chocolate and the smooth. This is the crispy ones. A little crunch inside of those eggs. And it's a five ounce bag. And then these are little foil wrapped eggs and they are caramel filled. And these are the Palmer brand, and this is a five ounce pack of those. And let's see, is this the same thing? Oh yeah, I did pick up two of those, so I have two of these little caramel eggs that I'm going to stick away. And actually, I'm going to use some of those in one of my DIYs. There's my garbage can. I don't know. And then I picked up three or four of these, actually. I thought these were really cute with the little Easter eggs and the grass. Um, I actually want to use the grass for something else. So I'm probably just going to take these all apart and use them for different things. But I love the eggs. I thought they were really pretty. They're not like a real fine glitter or anything, so they're not too messy. So I got this one. It's kind of like a yellowish-orange. And then I got one that is more of a pink. 
I guess I could consider that a pink. It's more of a pink color. And you only get three eggs on each one. But I thought that was cute. And then I got the purple one. And I grabbed a blue one. <clears throat> well, I don't know if anybody else has found any stickers for Easter. Oh, wait a minute. I have one more thing of candy. I picked up these cute little... Um, they're just little Easter eggs. It's just chocolate, uh, the crisp, double crisp bunny treats. Um, and they look like little, little carrots. So I just grabbed a little bag of those. They'll look cute in a little dish or something. But anyway, I don't know if anybody's seen any nice stickers for Easter. I know I couldn't find any at the Dollar Tree last year. But I did find these cute little sticker packs that they had. And it says there's 256 stickers in here. I'll just go through here quick and show you guys what they kind of look like. They're small. But they have such pretty ones out for like Valentine's Day and Christmas and a lot of glare on these. And for other holidays, even um, St. Patrick's Day, I found some nice stickers. But I haven't found any in the last few years for Easter. But they don't have everything out, like I said, yet. Hopefully they'll get some more out. And this was the other one I picked up, and this has 256 stickers, too. And I hope they're not all the same, with just a different thing on it. Yeah, they kind of look... I don't know if they are the same. Let me look here. They are kind of the same, but in different colors, so... They're a little bit different. Yeah, see, the other one was orange, this one's pink. And yeah, that's what they look like. They're tiny, but they're cute. But that is it. That is what I got at the Dollar Tree today. I'm lying. I have one more thing. I have these um, little plastic plates that you get by, they have back by the party in the wedding section. And it's just, there's eight of these little, I don't know what size these are, but they're the smaller plates. No, it does not say. Where's my ruler? They're like five and a half inch round plates that I'm going to use in a DIY too this year. So that is all that I got at the Dollar Tree today. I'm pretty sure that is it. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this fun little Dollar Tree haul and I hope everyone has a great weekend. I will see you guys all next time. So have a great day everyone.